Hello, a bit of a different video for you today. I've got the new 2018 Sony Compact Mobile and I'm in a very busy city, you can probably hear. And there's a bit of a clue as to where I am on my t-shirt. And I'm gonna be using this little mobile phone out and about around Havana. Just to show you, show you where I am. So I'm going to, um, so I'm basically going to be taking this mobile out and about today, getting some videos, photos, and giving it a good test. I've got my trusty, <laughs> I've also got with me my trusty OnePlus 5, and you can see it's a bit smaller than that. It's also a bit chunkier, so first impressions are that while it is smaller, it is a bit fatter. Um, and I have to say though, overall this is a nice looking, bit of kit if you're interested in a small phone. So I just need to pause this video for a moment because the traffic noise got really bad. To sum up, I work in the mobile industry and Sony have taken me and a group of others from the mobile industry away to Cuba for a few days. They've lent me the Xperia XZ2 Compact and unless stated, everything from here on out is filmed on that. So here's what we got up to when we visited Cuba. compact's been brilliant so far and it came in extra handy when I noticed that Colette, this is Colette, had a tendency to join in with everything. This is her storming the stage and joining in with a dance group. This is her storming a group playing some instruments and joining in. This is her dancing again. This is her creating some sugar water. This is her playing the piano, or at least attempting to. And this is her unloading a van of supplies because she just wanted to get involved with absolutely everything. And finally, this is her scaring the captain of the catamaranga as she tries to rev it up. What's uh, the place called? We're on a private island. On a private island. Off okay. The coast of Baradari. Thank you. <laughs> so we're on a private island off the coast of Baradero. I'm here to test the slow motion capabilities of the compact. In terms of image stabilisation, I think the OnePlus 5 has the edge here. I think Sony have got a bit of catching up to do. You can see the OnePlus 5 in the top left. The compact is still a little bit shaky. It doesn't really smooth out the image quite so well. Okay, so just going to do a front-facing camera test. So on the left, we've got the OnePlus 5 camera. On the right, we've got the compact camera. Let me know which one you think looks and sounds better. This is the sound from the OnePlus 5. You can hear the background of the waves. 
now this is the sound from the compact. The 5 has a slight edge over the compact being a slightly bigger screen, it makes it slightly better for doing vlogging, but I have to say the compact being compact makes it much easier to take around when on holiday. So my time in Cuba is coming to an end, I have to say it's been a fantastic trip, there's a lot to see and do, and the compact's been a great phone to bring with me. I especially like uh, the waterproofing on this, given that we were on a boat and water was getting splashed around all over the place, didn't have to worry. The slow-mo effect when you get a good capture looks brilliant, I'm really impressed with that. And I think the photos are really good as well. The compact's battery life was really good, I got it down to maybe 30% on a day of very heavy filming. Well, it's worth noting I haven't had a SIM card in this while in Cuba, so it's only been used for filming and taking photos, I haven't used it for calls, texts or data. This trip was actually organised by a company, they've arranged all the events, flights, accommodation and they've done a fantastic job. If you're looking for someone to arrange something for your work, whether it's an incentive for customers, I will put a link in the description below so you know who they are. I'll also put links to the phone and hotels I've visited and places I've been to. I hope you've enjoyed this little video, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please consider hitting the subscribe button. I'll see you next time.